Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today, and for the next probably eight or nine days in a row, it's gonna be raining every day. It is super cloudy and dark. And as you can tell, how wet everything is. It's been raining on and off so far all day today. It's around noon. So the sun should be straight up ahead. You can hear the thunder in the background, but it is really, really dark out here. And the question I wanna ask is, can you get any solar power on a cloudy, rainy day? I've got my favorite panel here. This is a very lightweight. It's a Love Knit 100 watt solar panel. I've got a couple of the one folded 100 watts and this one is super lightweight and very efficient. I take this one over the rest all the time. But I've got it into my little Palky 120 watt hour. And as you can see right at the moment, we're getting 7.2 watts right now. So short answer, yes, you can get solar on a cloudy, rainy day. Not much. And for this little 120 watt hour power bank, solar generator, that'll take a good while to charge up all the way. But as long as you're getting some solar, especially if you're out camping, this is a really good lightweight solution. These two right here. And I've also have a, a lightweight 60 watt solar, solar panel as well, folding solar panel. That pairs well with this one, especially in the summer when you have a lot of sun. Around about 60 watts, if you can get about 40 or 50 watts, this thing will charge in just a few hours. Since I plugged it in, it's been getting in between 13 watts and 6 watts, I've noticed. So, and like I said, where it's noon, the sun should be straight up overhead right now, and you can see how dark it is. I want to monitor this for just a little bit just to see how it does in the next little bit. I'll get a time just a minute and we'll come back and see how many watts we're getting. It's been just a few minutes. It was actually right at noon right now. During the last little segment, it was 11.56. I checked the time. I thought it was around noon. Right now, we're only getting 4.8 watts right now. It's getting darker and darker and darker. But I just want to see, especially if it starts raining or anything like that, just to see if we're getting any kind of energy, any kind of wattage whatsoever. Because if you have a set of waterproof solar panels and you're camping, if you can get a little bit of energy while it's raining, that helps out a whole lot. Going down a little bit more, 3.5 watts. We'll keep you updated. All right, it's been about 10 minutes and we're still getting around the same water, 3.5 to 4.5. I brought out my splitter. I've got a splitter right here and a 30 watt folding solar panel. I'm gonna see if that boosts that wattage up a little bit, just to see. Let's get that hooked up and we'll be right back. All right, it got even darker out here. And with the, just the 100 watt solar panel, we're getting 2.3 watts right now. So that's not good at all. Let's plug in the 15 watt, or the 30 watt, sorry, into that just to see if we get any more juice. There we go, got that plugged in. Did that boost any at all? negative so just by using that just the one solar panel at the moment is sufficient enough to get some power to this little power station as the clouds are moving by you can see as they're going moving in and out there 
I'm just going to stand here for just a little bit longer and see if we have any more improved power. But it is totally dark up there, guys. There's no blue sky in sight. All of the dark clouds all around me. Come out here and show you. cloud must have just went by it went up to 3.6 let's undo the 30 watt just to see if it changes got it right here and it did go down 2.3 let's plug it back up Just to show it's 2.3. I'll get back in there. Should have brought my tripod out here. Plug it back in. So it is helping a little bit. 3.6. Unplug it one more time. I'm getting ready to unplug it. 2.3. 3.6. Yeah, so it is helping. Stand out here just for a few more minutes just to see if anything changes. I was hoping it'd start raining a little bit too, just to see if we're getting any wattage whatsoever when it rains. All right, it's been about another 20 minutes or so. Still about the same, reading about the same. We're getting 1.1 watts right now just from the 100 watts. And I was gonna try another little experiment just for uh, experiment sake i still have the y splitter in there so i'm going to unhook the y splitter and just plug the solar panel in there it's just to see if that y splitter has any effect on the wattage outputted wattage output of the solar panel and that would be a negative this probably foot and a half piece of cable it did not affect the uh, wattage coming out of that solar panel whatsoever and it keeps chipping between the 1.1 1.5 to 6 watts 3 watts So it definitely is doable. Uh, put another 100 watt solar panel in with, in conjunction with this one. Beef it up just a little bit more, not much, but. Well, that was my experiment today, guys. I've been wanting, been waiting for it to get good and cloudy again so I can try that just to see if we're getting any solar power whatsoever when it is dark, rainy, and cloudy. That'll probably do it for today's experiment. If you liked the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Leave a comment down below if you don't mind. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Ring that bell for future video notifications. And if you look down in the description of the video, I'll leave a link for both of these products on Amazon. I don't think the... Uh, Solar panel is available at the moment. They sold out of those things. They were getting pretty popular. So lightweight, but I'll leave the, the, the links down in the description if you if you wanna check them out for both of them. The little power station, 120 watt Palkey power station is very inexpensive and is a great starter solar generator or even as just a backup to throw in your car. It's a really nice, inexpensive power station. Thanks for coming over. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next one. And as always, plan, prepare, 
in practice. Handy out. I need to spray some weeds. <laughs>